Hi, I'm Jim Wilcox, and I'm here today in the Consumer Reports TV test labs looking at a new Vizio 3D TV that uses passive 3D technology so you don't have to wear the bulky, costly glasses that current 3D TVs require. Instead, you can use lightweight, low-cost polarized glasses like these that come with the set or other universal pairs from makers such as Polaroid. Of course, we were curious to see how this TV would perform, so we brought it into our TV test lab and compared it to a top-rated Panasonic Active 3D TV. There's a lot to like about the new Vizio. The 3D image is much brighter than other sets we've seen. Also, there's minimal ghosting, so you won't see double images where you should only see one. But there are also drawbacks to passive 3D technology. The vertical resolution is only half that of an active 3D set, resulting in a less detailed picture. And testers noticed that very fine details tended to shimmer when you should see a solid image. Also, in some scenes you'll get flaws like jagged edges instead of smooth lines and moiré interference patterns. And while most Vizio sets have a wide viewing angle, this one doesn't. As you move to the side, the picture quality will deteriorate. The Vizio Passive 3D TV, which comes with four sets of lightweight, inexpensive glasses, may be a great option for many families. But if you're looking for the ultimate in 3D picture quality, it looks like the current active plasma sets are still the way to go. I'm Jim Wilcox for Consumer Reports.